I'm good. Um, still a little bit of jet lag in the mornings, waking up early, but it's okay. Um, and we uh, went uh, to see the circuit of the first stage, of the Sunday stage, okay. um, just before the, the press conference. So we know a little bit what to expect and pretty tough and challenging. Yeah. But as I said in the press conference, I still believe Peter is going to be there for the win, Tohoshoft. Yeah. Maybe not every sprinter is going to make it, mm -hmm. but uh, them two, they pretty tough That's cookies. Like so yeah, they're going to make it. Right. First of all, it's a bummer about Chris and I just you know wish him the best and hope that he comes back and finds his health and, and um, form or shape uh, back as soon as possible. Um, but yeah, I'm sure that um, Matthew is a good... Um, a good man to fill in this position. Mm -hmm. He was second, I believe, in Utah last year. Mm -hmm. yeah. So he knows how it is if the team rides for you. Mm -hmm. And as you said, he was 14 last year, but still riding for, uh, still riding for Chris. So I think winning is tough. I mean, there's some good, good riders here, you know. But um, I also don't think we really f expect or force him to, hey, you're gonna win. You know, we we take him as our leader. And then, <clears throat> who knows if uh, Bob Youngels any surprises, one or two, by going out on a stage, uh, maybe trying to get a stage win. We don't have a sprinter, so that wouldn't, wouldn't be in our interest to go passive or just hide and wait, mm -hmm. um, since we don't have a sprinter. Um, but um, I believe Messi is going to be good.